Hi, I'm Colin Spice Freak Sloss, here today with my buddy Lord Grimm. Hello. Alex, yeah. Yeah. And Lord Grimm, how's Lady Grimm doing? Pretty good nowadays, yeah. She's recently finished her uh, exams and she's uh, you know, spending time at home. So yeah, she's uh, okay. fun. You seeing her again anytime soon? Uh, yes, actually I'm seeing her on Thursday. So you got a few days then? Yep. Good. Because you might need a little bit of time to not have stinky breath after the sriracha. Okay, <laughs> fair enough. So, today we're going to be trying this sriracha and also this sriracha. And also this sriracha. Ooh. A three colours of sriracha traffic light challenge. They're not the hottest of sauces, but at the same time they're quite intense flavour and we'll be having four spoonfuls of each. Cool. So, let's get to it. I've had this first one before. I like it, but... You had the Flying Goose brand one? Or? Yes, the Flying Goose brand is one. Okay. They're slightly different to Hoi Fong, but not much. And if anything, I'm They've got more of a richier yes. That's not as full as mine, is it? Well, no, I'm getting more than one. Sorry to call you out on it this time. But call me on it. We're doing this challenge properly, we're doing it. Yeah, Show it to the camera? Oh, there we go. Let's put it I'll try not to. Hi, camera. Right, and three, two, one. That's nice. Hmm. a definite saltiness, red chili flavour, sort of rich earthy garlicness to the end. Yeah, it is. So, moving on to the yellow. Oh, what would you say its heat is, by the way? Heat, ooh, pretty large, it's pretty low. Uh, I'd say about a two ish or lower. Yeah, two's probably two. Two other right. So, moving on to the yellow. Hello, yellow. All sriracha is pretty viscous because it's just blended chilies and garlic mostly. Well, it does more viscous than that then. It's made into a liquid kind of by the addition of a bit of vinegar, not too much, and also by passing it through a sieve so that all the pieces become tiny. How's the squeeze on? A little bit more on that. Just get it to the edge. There we go. Show the camera. How are you doing on that? And let's go for it. Let's go. So that one's rather different up front. Ooh. Bit brighter, slight yeah. tang to it, not too much. It is a tang, yeah. It's very bright that one. Dude. I'd say it tastes slightly like golden cayenne, but it doesn't have the heat of when I've eaten golden cayenne raw. So yellow yeah, chili. Yeah. We're not totally sure what chili goes into it. It could be a yellow jalapeno, but it's not that much hotter than the original. So I'm suspecting it's more likely to be the cayenne. Well, I mean, it's like, it's like that one's nice. Like, you know, it's got like a, like a medium flavor in here. I said that one's got like about high. It, 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 it tastes, tastes like high rebellion, for instance. But high, it's like high heat, also a really, really strong flavor as well. It's got a bit of a higher heat, you say? As in my experience of both, I would say that's a two, that's two and a half. Yeah, fair enough. So, you ready to go to the green? I'm ready to the green. Green we go. Indeed. Green for giving this a go. That one, that, one, that one looks less viscous than the other one, but... I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's not as viscous as the other, is it? It's looking mm -hmm. more like... Wait, that one's like a... This one's more like a smoothie. There you go. How's that? green chili flavour, slightly almost musty up front. Yeah. But still like all of them has the same sort of rich earthy garlic finish to it. It does. 
And yeah, I'm a big fan of the green one. They're all similar. I would say from from a one test in the spoon, I would probably say the green is the best. Okay, which one do you say is the hottest? Hottest, uh, probably the yellow one. Personally. Okay. I think the green and the yellow are fairly similar in heat. They're both sort of high 2.5, maybe low 3. They're nothing crazy, but no. they're hotter than your standard reds for actually still. Yeah, no, I know I used to jump, maybe, maybe because I'm adapted to it now, but I know I used to jump up to that one. I didn't know, yeah. it, was, I didn't know it was like a lot, a lot less, a higher or lower with that one, so maybe it's similar. Yeah. So, in order of flavour, you're saying, wait, in order you're saying flavor. green best. In order of flavour, it would be like that. So green best, red second, yellow worst. Yes. Okay, and in order of heat, you're saying it's more like... More like... Yellow, hottest, green... Yellow, red. green, red, yeah, personally. Okay. But, I mean, none the, of them are bad. They're all quite nice. Yeah. I just uh, I just think that the the flavour and the heat of this one just kind of speaks for the most. Whereas that one's, that one's nice as well, but, like, just... The yeah, the, red, the green's better than the red is the flavour, and then the yellow one's just too, like, oof. You push in the face, so... Fair enough, yeah, the yellow one is... More of an intense, immediate flavour than yeah. the others. Not really looking for a fire sauce, do I think? I'm looking for a punch in the face. Fair. And, so, having started this new challenge, I would like to challenge Cooking Chili Club to match us on this. We challenge you. Is there anyone you would like to challenge, Lord Grimm? Oh, uh, me. Uh, I don't know, really. Uh, okay, how about I'm going to challenge X Band for this? Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been involved too? Yeah, when he comes back from China. Yeah. Or maybe in China if you can find it. So, we'll see you again for that sometime. This has been the Flying Goose brand Sriracha Chili Traffic Light Challenge. Bye. See ya.